Hey you guys, I really hope you guys can hear me. Um, I wanted to come today to talk about a dream that I had uh, a couple of days ago. Actually, it was, I believe, the 16th of August. Um, yeah, 16th. Yeah, 16th of August. It fell on a Tuesday during the week of 15, 16, 17. So it could be either the 16th or the 17th that I had this dream. And it was crazy because, you know, um, I remember seeing this guy and he was with this woman and the woman in the dream was like a very, she was like very queenly, like her energy was very queenly. She had like a royal feel to her. She just very beautiful, dark skinned woman just a goddess in every right and you could just tell <clears throat> um he had this woman and he was about to he had just brought her home and i guess he was about to smash or whatever and um next thing you know like i guess i got kind of curious and i started walking through the house and i walked into a bedroom where i think they were where i saw a mannequin and on the mannequin it had like tape on it like double-sided tape and the mannequin had little doll babies stuck to it and i'm just like bitch what is this like you know i'm already recognizing like some shit is like like some mm -hmm, some type of shit you know so i just felt like let me um let me pay attention to what is really going on here and then all of a sudden a scene flashes where I see Nicki, uh, Nicki Minaj's face and I saw Nicki with the bangs. It's something about Nicki with the bangs. It's something about a type of persona that comes with Nicki with the bangs. I don't know exactly what it means, but she makes that face that, you know how her mouth does this thing where it's like almost elongated and she's giving like a nasty ass smirk with her mouth like elongated. That look is associated with Nikki with the bangs and that look means something very fucking serious. I don't know what it, I don't know exactly what it means. But I know Nikki with the bangs is somebody who you don't want to fuck with because Nikki with the bangs is probably the one who is really um inclined to do certain things to get her way by any means necessary. So um, next thing you know, I remember looking down at um, the blanket. There was a purple blanket there, and, and under the purple blanket, I couldn't, honestly, I could not tell you guys what was under there, but I just had a feeling of, girl, get out of here. So I found myself flying out the room, and I flew down the stairs. I actually, at one point in the dream, while I was going down the stairs, I levitated down. Like, I was in such, oh, it was like a speedy, get out of here type of feel to where I started to float and levitate down the fucking stairs because I was trying to get away from whatever was under that purple blanket with, with speed. And then um, that's pretty much, I remember seeing two children. I think it was a boy and a girl, but mainly the girl I remember in the dream. So they were just like children that were there and like siblings. Um, and then um, at the end of the dream, I remember seeing Ajna who does uh, Ajna Tarot, she, she was sitting there and she was clenching her dress in the area of the bosom. She had it, it was like she was holding it together while looking at the news. So I don't know, there was something on the news. Um, I don't know, there was some kind of, I, I just remember seeing her and she had this Tourette's type of situation going on, but she was actually ticking with it. Like her head was like ticking, like, you know, she would just tick, like, you know, and I don't know what exactly what that meant, but I have a good idea of what I think it means. And, you know, God, I ask that God just stop any and all negative stuff that people are doing behind the scenes, um, especially towards others, you know, because um, I really feel like that ticking was a result of something that was um, being done to her and causing her to have these issues. So that's just like my, um, 
my thought about that that end part because i don't know this girl personally i just watch her on youtube and i love her videos and she's awesome and she's all about um empowerment of women and allowing women to be themselves be free with their cleavage and things like that and not having to wear bras and it was interesting to know that the, she represents that in real life but to see her in my dream state hold in a grandma dress sitting on a couch with a head wrap on it's like she's a very conservative person it's like regardless of what she shows she is actually very conservative like she just believes that why should i have to cover myself up because i'm a woman these breasts come with me and I should be able to wear what I want, but I really am a respectable person and you're going to respect me regardless, you know, so she, um, I don't know. I just, I don't know. I want to get a chance to talk to her and maybe even find out what she thinks about that. Uh, so yeah, that's my dream. But Nikki with the bangs, watch out. Cause I don't know when you see Nikki with the bangs again, she is about to cause fucking trouble. <laughs> She about to do some shit, y'all. Like, watch out for Nikki with the bangs.